Hiya folks, bringing you another LCPGL match. Uh, my opponent today, if I recall correctly, was pretty highly rated when I went against him, and I was looking at his team and I was really confused as to why. He's got such crap Pokemon on his team. Mischievous really is not good for uh, the PGL competition because Sneasel's everywhere. I mean, yeah, he's got a Sneasel of his own, but that's really the only big threat I see on this team. You know, Voltorb? Mm-mm. Um, Numble? Uh, I don't think is competitive at all. Uh, Riolu, highly overrated. Now, he does have that Remoraid, but in my experience on the latter, Remoraid is just a very situational Pokemon that it's a little difficult to pull off. So, based on the Pokemon that he's bringing, I'm thinking, you know, I think Surfskit is a pretty safe bet to bring in, because I think I'll be able to set up the Sticky Web quite easily. Um, and then from there, the other two are Sneasel and Tangela. I figured Tangela over Murkrow for countering the Pokemon on his team, because it is a physical wall, and it does also... Um, yeah, so anyway, I lead off with Surskit. He leads off with Remoraid, and I'm thinking, mm, was this a bad idea? So I go ahead and get off my Sticky Web as he protects first turn. I was predicting him to protect, predicting him to protect first turn, so I figured this should work out great. So, um, he goes, to, so he does have Moody, and, um, I'm going to have a little Moody tracker at the top of the screen. I wish I had been able to do this during the battle, but, uh, yeah, I just, it's too much to keep track of. It's one thing on, um, Pokemon Showdown. But, yeah, no way I would have been able to keep track of it, actually, in this battle. So, he goes ahead and subs up, and I'm thinking to myself, huh, this is going to be difficult. So, um, he is at minus one speed right now. Um, his special defense is through the roof, so I really do want a physical attacker, not a special attacker, out. Um, and he goes ahead and protects, and I'm thinking, you know, he's got the leftovers, he's got the, uh, he's got the protect and the sub, and I'm thinking, you know, I'm Life Orb. Even without attacking me, he can get rid of me just by staying in and doing nothing. So, minus one special attack, plus four special defense, minus one speed. Now we're at plus two attack. This is, you know, Moody's just insane. So I go ahead and uh, use Brick Break. His substitute fades, um, because luckily he hasn't gotten any defense boost. But again, you know, I'm getting a little bit concerned about Life Orb Recoil. And something, this is really not the best Pokemon to have out. Um, you know, I, I don't think I've been tracking the special defense raises. I definitely didn't realize that he was a plus four. Otherwise, um, I think I might have just left Sneasel in and just dealt with a life orb recoil. Um, yeah, accuracy, uh, accuracy is kind of like the, when you get a boost in accuracy in LCPG, or in, um, with Moody, then that's kind of worthless. So anyway, on the predicted protect, on the predicted protect, I go ahead and switch out. I go into Tangela, because Tangela should be able to wall him fairly well, I think. Think so. Um, his speed goes up. He's still at minus. He, you know his. Uh, so he's now at zero speed or neutral speed. So it goes ahead and uses soak. And I'm thinking soak. That's weird and random. I went for ancient power, so it's not like I lost stab. I wouldn't have gone for ancient power had I realized he was still at plus three special defense. I would have gone for the maximum lead, maximum damaging Giga Drain. Um, here I'm pretty sure I, uh, from here, I, the best move is to switch out into Sludge Bomb, because now that it's no longer Stab, it doesn't matter. He goes for Bullet Seed, and I'm thinking, oh, holy crap, with Soak, that's super effective. And I was like, please only hit three times, I'll switch out and regain my Grass Typing, and it hits um, four times, takes out my Tangela, and I'm thinking, this is ridiculous, I'm going to lose this battle to a freaking Remoraid. So, um... Yeah, I'm just I'm just boned here. There is nothing I can do. Um, so and he just keeps getting boosts here. Um, so now he's at plus two defense in addition to plus uh, plus two defense plus two special defense. I go out into search kit because I didn't I wasn't tracking this uh, special defense. I was only tracking the defense something. Oh well, I want a physical uh, special attacker out now. Um, he's just going to go out and protect. I go for Signal Beam for maximum accuracy, and also it will do more damage because it's not resisted, unlike Hydro Pump. Um, but, you know, I don't really see a way out of this other than, you know, getting really lucky with the Moody drops. So he goes ahead and goes for Bullet Seed and thinks, please don't one-hit KO. So one hit looks like it's going to take four or five hits to kill. Two hits, oh, three hits, okay, survive, 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 and four hits, he takes me out. So Surskit is down in one turn, and yeah, I just don't see, I just don't see winning here at all, I really don't. 
Um, so he's getting, he's basically at full health thanks to leftovers. Um, the one situation where I think leftovers is justified in the LCPGL tournament, um, I saw lots of people running leftovers just because they had, uh, you know, substitute and protect, but yeah, only, this is the only case where it goes. So anyway, he's at plus two evasion now, um, and my knockoff misses, and this is just, uh, this is not going well. Uh, I do not see any way to win this. Uh, and now it's just a matter of, you know, I gotta go through with it. I gotta, you know, see if maybe I can pull something out. Maybe, uh, Moody will help me out. And here his accuracy falls. And I think, oh, thank you, God. This is my one saving grace. If, uh, he can miss some moves, and I can hit some moves. He's a plus two evasion, minus one accuracy. So, you know, it, I'm more likely to miss him than he has to miss me. But here it just goes off so well. He is, has no sub. I should be faster. If I can hit him with an attack, then I really might be able to KO him and come back in this match, which would be so freaking exciting. I no longer have my stabs. Unfortunately, my attack misses here because he says he's got plus four evasion, and his attack hits, and it's, he only needs two hits to kill me, and, you know, bullet seed is guaranteed at least two hits. So Sneasel goes down, and that is, unfortunately, the really, really bad game. Um, it's, it's ridiculous to me that... Um, PGL would ban Eviolite and not Moody. I'm sorry, it's just ridiculous. And, you know, whatever. Um, I actually would really like to hear from people watching this battle, how am I su how are you supposed to deal with Remoraid in this kind of situation? I mean, is it just a matter of, well, you lose, or there's just gotta be something to it, right? There's gotta be some kind of trick. Oh well.